In your health news, a pair of best friends who have helped each other through thick and thin for 30 years are now even more bonded for life. After one gave the other the gift of a second chance at life. News 12's Virginia Huey has the story you will see only on 12. When Eleanor Lalima and Lisa Henschel met in the first grade, they clicked right away. She's a good person. She's funny. She's real. She's trustworthy. Over the years, the best friends forged a special bond, sharing the best of times in school, the prom, graduation, weddings, and motherhood. Our friendship was always strong throughout all the years. The pair leaned on that strength when the worst of times hit three months ago. Doctors told Eleanor she was in kidney failure and needed a transplant. The situation was dire because Eleanor's mother and brother died from the same kidney disease that was threatening her life. I was sad. I was like, oh my God, I got to get a kidney. I don't want to be like my mother, my brother. Lisa offered to donate one of her kidneys to her best friend of 30 years without hesitation. That's what you do when you have a friend, you know, especially after watching what her mother and brother went through and then losing them. I, I wasn't about to sit back and watch her go through that. Tess showed Lisa was a perfect match for Eleanor. On May 25th, they underwent surgery at Stony Brook University Hospital. Eleanor's surgeon, Dr. Wayne Walter, says the transplant was a success. Prognosis looks excellent, uh, you know, doing very well. Dr. Frank Darris well. says Lisa is a hero for stepping up in her best friend's time of need. All the donors, that's what we call them. They are the hero because nothing happens without them. Eleanor and Lisa are sharing their story in hopes of raising awareness about kidney disease and the importance of organ donation. If more people did it, then, you know, more people would have a better quality of life. Lisa's gift is giving Eleanor a chance to live a full life with her family. She saved my life and she gave me a chance at life. That means so much to me and I can't even thank her enough. And I love her with all my heart. Virginia Huey, News 12, Long Island.